What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Game Channel. My name's AJ Gales. How y'all doing? Do you hear that? You hear that beautiful sound? It is the sound of a new generation dawning. I have my Xbox Series X all hooked up. I am all good to go uh, with uh, next-gen consoles and everything. I uh, got my Xbox today. I'll be getting my PS5 on Thursday, on the 12th, hopefully. Uh, again, I don't trust the Postal Service. <laughs> that is why I say hopefully. But either way, uh, as I said, this is going to be our very first uh, LP in the next generation and the very first on Xbox Series X. I, I mean, when I was looking at games to do, you know, I mean, originally I was going to play Dirt 5, and I'm like, eh, maybe, uh, you know, I decided against it. You know, I knew I was going to play Gears Tactics, but I was like, you know what, but I want to play a new game as the first one uh, of this generation. And I thought, you know what? If we're going to play a new game, let's play one by one of my favorite studios, one of the craziest studios out there, Ryu Gagotoku, the developers of the Yakuza franchise, and their new game, Yakuza Like a Dragon, or Yakuza 7, depending on whichever one you want to say. Um, this is a series that I absolutely adore. Uh, I, I've not played every one. I've played the original two games, you know, one and two, like the originals on PS2. I've played both Kiwami 1 and 2 on the channel. I played Yakuza 0 on the channel. I have the remasters of uh, 3, 4, 5. Uh, and I, I can pick up six easily for the PS4, so, you know, I'll, I'll probably somewhere down the road play the entire franchise. But uh, with seven coming out on the next gen again, like I said, I thought this was a perfect time. You know, we'll break in the new Xbox, play a new Yaku uh, play in the Yakuza game. Uh, we're going to be playing with English audio, English subtitles, all that, obviously. Um, this is set in the Yakuza world. Obviously, it is a Yakuza game, but it's not tied directly to the original Yakuza games. Uh, you know, it's an entirely new cast, entirely new character. I mean, the families and stuff are going to remain. It's similar to, like, what Judgment did. It was set in the Yakuza world, but it was its own self-contained story. So that's what's going on here. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I really want to get to real quick. Uh, I will be doing a, um, kind of, a, of my thoughts on the next-gen hardware, uh, in the coming uh, week or so. Uh, I'm not sure how long it's going to take until I get that done, but again, I just want to you know, spend a little bit of time with both my consoles before I make my final decision uh, on what I like, what I don't like, yada, 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 first impressions, etc. Um, I said yada, yada, and etc. in the same sentence. Son of a bitch. I, I, I just woke up from a nap. Sorry. <laughs> um, so I'm a little, I'm a little wired. Uh, other than that, I uh, expect one other new game today. Obviously, I'm going to be playing Gears Tactics. Um, I will be playing a third Xbox Series X game this week, uh, but we're going to be doing uh, the new Call of Duty on Series X. If you're wondering when I'm going to start on PlayStation when I get that, uh, that will be the new Spider-Man game, uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla, and holy shit, Godfall. There we go. So, uh, yeah, six new series this week. A lot of new stuff. Um, yeah. So there you go. Eh, thank you for supporting, blah, blah, blah. I know, before anyone tells me in the comments, dude, you need to keep your intro shorter. I know. I'm long-winded. I can't help it. Chapter 1, Light and Shadow. Long have I waited for this day. I know you can't have forgotten my face. Do not pretend otherwise. Iaman was the name of the courtier you murdered in Suriga. That man was my father. You don't mean. You're that girl from before. I'm not that girl anymore. I am a vagrant on a quest for vengeance. Do you know how many times I've awoken in the night, having dreamt of drawing this dagger? Today, finally, my blade will have its due! Quiet! Men, have your way with her! Huh. You actually believe I would ever let myself be cut down by a mere woman? I will teach you your place, for I am none other than the fearsome Ginji the Slasher, the legendary Terror of Edo! I don't know if you're that scary. I, I, you don't have an anime name after you. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> oh, the hammy acting. It's great. 
You fool of a man. Genji the Slasher is none other than I. Oh, plot twist. Did you see that? Father. Bravo! 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 Bravissimo! Magnificent! Wonderful! Masumi! Did you finish cutting that confetti? No. Not yet. Then what are you sitting around for? We leave for Osaka in the morning! <laughs> Look at you. You got the audience to its feet and suddenly you think you're a star? This Jesus. kind of money is nothing, so don't let it go to your head. You ungrateful little brat. Don't you look at me like that. I can't believe this is how you treat your mother. I can't believe this is how you treat your kid. Make the next cut even deeper. And this time, not even your makeup will hide it. Yoko, stop it. <laughs> Don't you dare try to order me around, Toshio. Who do you think keeps this whole damn show running? <sighs> Tora chan. Shall we go to Motomachi tonight? Hmm? Are you sure? <laughs> Who cares about all this? Don't worry about the confetti. Let me give you a hand. I should have time to finish it in the truck tomorrow. I may never be an award-winning actor, but I've always been a masterful confetti cutter. Every actor needs a backup plan. <laughs> what do you say we hit the town tonight? See the sights of Yokohama. Just the two of us. Come on. Okay. So, Masumi, did you say goodbye to all your friends in Yokohama? I don't have any friends. What's the point if you switch schools every month? Come on, don't be like that. You know, when I was your age, my parents wouldn't even let me go to school. Hey, why don't we treat ourselves today? I know, how about Peking Duck, the king of Chinese food? Ah, the duck is dried in the sun, then roasted, and the skin comes out so crispy and delicious, you'll love it. If it's the king of Chinese food, it must be expensive. <laughs> Don't you worry about that. 
Indulging ourselves for one night won't break the bank. You know, real quick, to anybody who knows something about like Japanese culture and whatnot, what was with the the money uh, hanging around the uh, hanging around um, that guy's neck? That the instead, of, you know, because I know here in the West it's typically like flowers or something that you give to like the lead actor or star. But what's what's with the Whoa, the money? Is that just a thing in Japan? Just, get full is there like some meaning to it? I'm, I'm curious. These appetizers are just the bit players. The main course has yet to take the stage. Yeah, I know. I'm going to the bathroom before the star gets here. Okay, I have a feeling I know what crime this is. I'll, I'll go further in a second. Dad? Dad? Never mind. I guess I don't know what crime that was. Cause I, cause I know the whole. Here we are. Sorry. The last day of the twentieth century. Masumi uh, Arakawa, patriarch of the Arakawa family, a Tojo clan subsidiary. And all I can think about is what I want for lunch. Hey Ichi. I sent Ichi out to do collections. Joe Sawashiro, captain of the Arakawa family, a Tojo clan subsidiary. On New Year's Eve? If there's money on the streets and there's work to be done, Yakuza don't get holidays in Kamurocho. Life's a bitch, and then you die. I like the snakeskin shirt. Um... No, I thought that murder was going to be what uh, our main character here, Ichi, is accused of. What? And get caught? Get fucked, you cum stain! <laughs> Holy shit, okay. That's some language. Oh, cool, they're bringing this back from Judgment. Oh, I love these stupid chase missions. Uh, thrill the chase and navigate the city without bumping into obstacles. Display inputs. Okay. Again, this was this was in judgment. I I also think they did something similar in Yakuza's yeah, three or four. It was like chase battles, but no, like I was saying, uh, this game. Uh, obviously, this is this is our main character uh, Ichi, uh, member of the the Arakawa family, I believe. Um, from what I remember of you know all the preview material that we saw was that uh, he ends up going to prison for a crime he didn't commit. Yeah, it kind of like Kiryu, except Kiryu, you know, was taking the blame for a buddy. He did it, you know. Oh, shit, you're kidding me. Oh, thank God. I'm like, oh, you're kidding me. Did my game crash? <laughs> uh, well, Ichi does it, you know, for the family. <laughs> Ushio, pal. I know you're not an idiot. Why did you think you'd get away with hawking this? There's nothing illegal about selling animal fuck videos. Believe me, it's education. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I believe. Time out. The problem is you were calling it uncensored porn and selling it to dumb, horny kids. Oh, okay. Ichiban, do me a solid. Remember all the good times we had in middle school? And let's be real. It's not like this is hurting the Yakuza's bottom line. Actually, it is. Big time. 
Kids these days are entitled, man. They'll come bitching the Arakawa family about porn scammers on our turf. We can't have that kind of shit staining our good name. So come on. Cough up the cash you squeeze out of them. Oh, really? Brass knuckles? Oh, are we gonna see the new combat system? Did you forget who you're dealing with? Of course not. Just some Yakuza street trash who's gotta learn when to quit! Are you kidding me? I'm the next dragon, motherfucker. Hirotaka, whatever the hell his last name was. Alright, so this is the new combat system. Uh, I'll finish what I was saying about the, the story in a second, but uh, this is the new combat system. It, this is it, It's gone from a typical like beat-em-up sort of, li uh, I almost said live action, real-time action brawler to a pseudo turn-based RPG. I don't get. I I don't know how they're gonna do this, but I'm I'm excited to find out. Uh, during battle, you will select which actions to take using the commands menu in the bottom left corner of the screen. Select attack command to attack with a weapon or hand. Give it a shot. All right. So. That all you got? <laughs> so it's not you know like you, you line up. Apparently, you can move around and your enemies move around the battlefield all at the same time, but it is still turn based and whatnot in terms of action and attacks. If you can select attack again before a fallen enemy gets back up, a regular attack will change into a powerful opportune strike. Opportune strikes really dish out the pain, so take every chance you get them. Okay. So because he's down, and I hit attack again, I was able to get him before he gets up. Yeah. Okay, using items, the red gauge at the bottom uh, right is your HP. If Kasuga's HP reaches zero, it's game over. HP can be recovered by using items. Why not take this opportunity to take a bite of your onigiri now? Any flavor will do, etc. Items, uh, yeah, let's uh, have some salmon onigiri. Cool. I like how you see him eat it too. Uh, select guard uh, for Kasuga to defend himself until the next turn. This will decrease the enemy, or this will decrease... Uh, the damage you take protecting against both bleeding and stun. If you know the enemy's next attack will be a powerful one, it might be best to put up your guard. Just a thought. Yeah. All right, that's it for the tutorial. Time to teach Ushio a lesson. One last thing. If there's ever anything like a bicycle or a street sign near an enemy, a normal attack will change into a weapon attack, leading one to use, or in some case, kick the nearby object and unleash some serious hurt. Okay. So using RT, I can kind of change... See, I thought I could move around. Apparently, I can't. We're all, we're kind of, I'm stationary. You like this? Cool. Okay, it's a little weird, but. Cool. It's a little weird. I'm going to have to get used to it, but I don't hate it. Oh, yeah. Then there's a... It says job experience. Yes, there is also a job system here in this game. It's... Uh, I'm. It's going to take some getting used to, uh, but I'm, I'm into it, man. I'm into it. Ichiban Kasuga of the Arakawa family at Tojo Clan subsidiary. Ichiban Aniki, you okay? I love his suit. Mitsuo uh, Yasumura of the Arakawa family, oh. Tojo Clan subsidiary. Oh yeah, check this out, man. Whoa, payday! <laughs> that guy was pretty fucking loaded. Yeah, he was always coming up with crazy business schemes back in the day. Well, some of them must have worked. The cash you got there might hit our quota today all by itself. What are you talking about? We're gonna give this all back to those kids. Uh, after all the work we did to get it, man? Yeah, dude. Hold up. You want me to track down every single kid this guy shafted? For real? Yes, for real. What part of this is hard to understand? <sighs> <sighs> Nothing. I get it. Fuck. Yeah, hey, look at this real quick. Huh? How bad is it? Fucker got me with his brass knuckles. 
Yeah, you've got a good size lump there, dude. No, you idiot. I mean my hair. I just got it done. And it was looking real fresh, too. <laughs> I can't believe this shit, stupid Ushio. Well, let me see if I can fix it. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad. You just gotta, you know. Don't to touch it. Hey, see, I, th this is actually what I'm kind of excited about, that Ichiban is kind of a, a much more... Damn, I choked. Um... Bunch of hits to the face. A, 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 a lot more of a... You're always getting pummeled there. I want to say charismatic guy than Kiryu. You calling me a masochist? <laughs> Hell yeah. You always let him get some punches in. Even when you could wipe the floor with him. I know how you fight hard when you want to. Yes, I do let him do that. Pretty masochist, if you ask me. Unless you're training to become a pro wrestler or something. Okay, fine. I guess I can see how it comes across that way. That ain't it. I'm just doing, you know, what a hero would do. A hero? Sure. I pretend I'm a hero when I fight. So what? When it's time to throw down, my brain just starts thinking in Dragon Quest terms. <laughs> uh, again with the Dragon Quest? What's so great about it? Everything. It's an epic and dangerous journey, and that's exactly how I see real life. <sighs> you do know you're a freaking Yakuza, right? If even one guy gets a lucky hit and it's all over for you, you realize that, dude? How many times has Captain Sawashiro told you that? I kill a guy over something as stupid as collections, that's when it's all over. Look, I like this life with Arakawa-san, the captain, and even your dumbass. I'm not gonna do anything to ruin that. Truth is, I never want to be at rock bottom again. Again? So, rock bottom was when you were cooped up in that Soapland office playing non-stop Dragon Quest? <laughs> Wouldn't be the man I am today without it. A cool guy. Full of the bravery those games showed me, and what they didn't, Arakawa-san did. That's where you get all this hero crap, huh? <laughs> Maybe I should give this gamer shit a chance. Do it, man. But first, let's give that money back to the kids who got scammed. Oh, <laughs> right. All right, so many things I want to cover that was, you know, uh, that was, you know, mentioned all during this bit. Time to bit. give those kids some refunds. Yes, we get Thanks. that. Let's go. Meet me up at the SIG shop when you're done. Sure. All right, as I was saying, um, one, Ichiban is very much a uh, goofy, old man talking, loudmouth in a way. Good, good. Hey, did you know Mama Michio is looking for you? She wanted you to swing by. What's she need with me? No clue. I'm just the messenger. <sighs> What's she gotten herself into now? You know, where Kiryu was very much a Duty call. stoic, silent kind of hero, and I'm not counting, you know, the uh, the side stories and whatnot. Uh, Kiryu was very much a kind of a silent, stoic guy, like I said. Uh, Ichiban is a little more boisterous. He's a l bit of a loud mouth, and, and I like that out of him. You know, I, I kind of like that they switched the hero, especially with some of the crazy shit we've seen out of this game. Like, my favorite is there's, like, summons that you can do, you know, kind of like when you summon something in Final Fantasy, except uh, you've seen Ichiban, like, tap and swipe on a phone, and then lobsters fall from the sky. It's stupid and ridiculous in only the way that Ryu Gagatoku can do, or maybe Suda51, but that's beside the point. Um... Yeah, it's just he—he's a little bit more of a crazy guy, and I—I and I, I like that out of a character in a Yakuza game. I'm oh, okay, they're, they're doing this uh, again. We're in—we're uh, back in Kamarocho. If anybody hasn't figured out, it's the same old Kamarocho that it's always been. Um, there was one other thing. Um, so there was that I was talking about. Uh, oh right, the—the the general plot of this game. Yeah, Ichiban is going to eventually. Uh, turn himself in for a crime that he didn't commit to kind of protect the family. It's kind of, you know, what he did, you know, kind of, like I said, kind of what Kiryu did, except Kiryu did it to save uh, Ishiki. Uh, it, it's a, or Nishiki, sorry, I don't know why I said that wrong. Um, you know, so a little different, but again, he volunteers to take the rap to uh, save the family. He comes out of prison expecting to, you know, be looked at as a hero, and he's basically thrown into the trash. 
So it, it's kind of similar to Kiryu's story in a way, but it's still kind of different. Um, all that, so, yeah. Uh, there, there was one other thing I wanted to talk about. Yeah, the new combat system, eh, a little weird, but... Oh, okay, so hitting LB, I can... Okay, I can put my health bar and everything up. Okay. Uh, the new combat system, uh, interesting. Like I said, it's going to take a little bit getting used to, but... Uh, I'm I'm willing to learn. It's cool. Uh, but, uh, God damn it! Is when he was he was in, uh, interrogating that guy. Oh right, when he when the guy yelled, "What animal fuck videos aren't what?" I, I'm just like, um, I'm pretty sure bestiality is illegal in most countries. Or maybe that's just me being you know from the U.S. I'm sorry, I heard a like a like a ping or something. I thought there was an item nearby. You know, so, so I'm thinking, like, what is it? Like a dude fucking a horse? Like, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's illegal. And then I'm like, oh, no. He he basically means it's like dogs humping or something like that. And then I love that Ichi gets mad at him because, you know, he's like, you're claiming it's uncensored porn to kids. And that's just... Oh, it's just dumb in the best way possible. Hey there, Ichi! You've kept me waiting. Have a drink with me, will ya? It's New Year's Eve. Wait, please don't tell me you were just looking for a drinking buddy. What? You were the only guy I knew who wouldn't have anywhere else to be on New Year's. Are you serious? I'm out here busting my ass making collections. Oh, well, look at you. So big and important. At least I'm not drunk. Hey, I've been drinking since before you were a twinkle in your dad's eye. And look at me now. Still gorgeous. Huh. Yeah, let's be nice. Yourself, uh... Liver probably ain't so gorgeous. But keep it up, and your only drink's gonna be when they wash your grave. Oh, I kindness increase. Sorry, Interesting. <laughs> I do appreciate it. Okay, so there's even a personality meter. Oh, this is interesting. Kasuga's personality may improve depending on his actions. These traits represent Kasuga as a person, and refining them will earn him a slew of perks and bonuses, such as unlocking new features or characters to talk to. Oh, that is really cool. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, it's, it, it's basically like uh, your social stats in a Persona game. Uh, the following six traits are Kasuga's personality, passion, confidence, charisma, kindness, intellect, and style. Try out all different activities to make Kasuga the very best man he can be. Alright. You're back! Why'd you do me like that? Michio was just drunk off her ass. You're surprised? I haven't seen her sober in 20 years. Her and this town are just going to hell. Heck, there's some trouble at Shangri-La right now. Huh? What happened? I don't know the details, but you know how soap lands are. Yeah, maybe a customer got uppity with one of the girls. You ought to go check. Damn it. Okay, so yeah, so I got a uh, so I got a character buff or not a buff, but you know, I I got something increased because I helped uh, because I helped her out. Okay, that's cool. So, passion, I'm lifeless. Style, I'm tasteless. Intellect, I'm a dumbass. Callous, repulsive, and I'm a pushover. Okay. Yeah, jobs as far as right now. I love even the sword shield like they're mentioned in Dragon Quest. Oh my god. I It's dumb, and I love it so much. Ichiban Kasuga exclusive job uh, relies on bare knuckle brawling ka and Kasuga's pro wrestling moves to knock enemies senseless. High offensive job that allows Kasuga to learn terrain based skills. Oh my god, that's cool. Part time hero, dragon cart. Um, you know what? Unlike what I've done in past Yakuza games, I'm 
actually going to um Costco puts all So okay, so is this I'm not sure how that works. Oh, okay, so I can put shortcuts. Okay. So we'll have to see in our next fight how skills work. Um I'm I'm you know what? I'm gonna record everything for this one. You know, I might kinda do what I do for some other series, you know, do some like extra long videos where we just kind of explore Kamadocho and uh, I believe Yokohama is the other location. Um you know, do side stuff, you know, hang you know, kinda mess around with the job system and you know, just RPG stuff. Perfect timing. We've got a huge problem. What's wrong? The toilet's all clogged up and we can't find a plunger anywhere. <laughs> a plunger? Yeah, that thing you use when there's shit stuck in the pipes. <laughs> you know what it is, but come on. We're Yakuza, not your handyman. Well, excuse me. I suppose it wasn't me who cleaned you up every time you shit yourself. I was a baby. Oh, you had accidents until fifth grade. One time. And my stomach was killing me that day. Guess I should get that plunger. Maybe the old lady at the smoke shop's got one. <laughs> All right. That's wonderful. So, yeah, like I was saying, uh, I plan on showing, you know, pretty much anything I come across, I find, you know. Uh, we might just do longer videos for this one, you know, expect maybe hour to a hour and a half huh. with the series. You know, as always, it's just kind of depending on whatever feels right to me. And you know me, I'm partial to longer videos, mm -hmm. so, eh. Oh, sorry. Oh, apparently it's uh, New Year's Eve tax, buddy. I mean, cigs and beer uh, have a luxury tax on them, don't they? So good time. Uh, so good times on New Year's uh, cost a little extra too. Why would I? Uh, why would I pay that to you then? Just get out your goddamn wallet. That's the lamest shit I've ever heard. Get out of here, punks. Huh? Who the hell are you? I was just cruising by. It's New Year's. Can't you just let people chill tonight? Sorry, <laughs> we're open for business on the holidays. So if you want to mess with our business. We'll just have to bust up yours. Oh, pretty scary. The lowlifes like you give Kamadocho a bad name. And I'm not about to stand for that. <laughs> get, get off your fucking high horse. Fuck it. Let's kill this guy. Uh, no, what I what I didn't notice is that apparently uh, the dialogue was on auto. So I couldn't just kind of let it sit there and let me talk. Uh, select skills to unleash your special attacks. There are three types of skills. Attack, recovery, and support. On-screen prompts may appear during uh, attack skills, which offer opportunities to deal extra damage by pressing X repeatedly or by pressing Y at the right time. Skills cost MP, mental points, uh, to activate, and your current MP can be seen as a green gauge if I'm right. Keep an eye on it. Okay. Let's use Tenacious Fist. Let's hit the one who's acting next. Got some extra damage and knocked him the shit out. Oh, fuck you. Ah, oh, you're cutting me, you bastard. Okay, uh, press B in time with the enemy's attack to perform a perfect guard and decrease the damage. You can perform a perfect guard at any time. Uh, Casca is standing, uh, much like the guard command, a perfect guard uh, will also defend against the bleeding and stun stuff. Okay. Let's take out the guy with the knife. Not nah, take him out. Damn it, you're dead next time I see you. Th thank you. <laughs> no sweat, buddy. <laughs> but for real, Kamarocha is more dangerous than usual on New Year's. Everyone's drunk and waving the cash around. It's easy pickings out here tonight, so be careful, okay? Hi. I will. Thank you very much. 
I guess I better get that damn plunger uh, from the lady at the cigarette shop. So yeah, it's weird I can't move around. Um, sorry, I'll let this play. Yeah. If you have one, could you run into Shangri-La? Just buy one for them. They raised you for crying out loud. A man your age should be sending money to his family anyway. <sighs> you think I can afford that? I'm barely scraping by as is. Well, then you need to leave that sorry Arakawa family and join a family with some real push, kid. Sure, you'd be their gopher for a while, but that'd still be better than how you're living now, right? You're an idiot. I swore an oath to Arakawa-san, and I never abandoned him. <laughs> Aren't you an obedient little dog? Hey, I heard something real cute about you. You're babysitting Arakawa's kid? Ha! Ichi the nanny! Hey, look, the young master's the same age as me. He's not a kid. Young master? What is this, the 18th century? Besides, I'm not babysitting him. I'm his caretaker. He's been in a wheelchair since he was a toddler, you know? Oh, so he needs a big, strong Yakuza at his side every time he wants some fresh air? I like this lady. Arakawa's going soft in his old age. Surprise, surprise. Hey. Try saying one more word about Arakawa, and see what happens. Hey, Aniki. Yo. I love this dude's you shirt. Those high schoolers their money back? Yep. Never seen kids happier to see a Yakuza before. It all worked out. See, they ain't so bad. Dude, there's no reason to be happy about it. If we don't score big on our next job, the captain's going to kill us. I know that. What is our next job, anyway? It's a shakedown. Our mark borrowed 500k from a loan shark and hasn't paid back a single yen. And apparently, he's immune to Yakuza threats. But we thought we'd give it a shot, so we bought the loan. Well, let's go, man. The dignity of the Arakawa family is riding on us. <laughs> I hope that's not true. Hey, by the way, Captain Sawashiro said to pull out all the stops to get this money back. So we might have to rough him up. All right, so where is this clown now? I hear he hangs out around Public Park 3 a lot. I'll go on ahead and scope it out. Meet me over there, okay? All right. All right, I want to see, can I turn... Battle speed normal. I'll put on high resolution, see if everything, you know, doesn't look completely weird. Uh, <laughs> oh, I was like, can I turn blood level on to extreme? Action prompts, battle speed, graphics, um... No, it doesn't look like I can turn off that auto. Oh, maybe I'm not looking in the right spot. Oh, cool, so we can actually go through all our characters and everyone. Um... You know, I'll go over those when we got more characters. Audio language, text language. Yeah, I can't see anything that's going to let me change that. It's bugging me, though. Oh, well. It means I can't just sit on dialogue and opine. Order recommendations. Select from the menu. Oh, cool. So I can have menu sets. Okay. And those will give me random... Uh, those will give me uh, buffs or something like that. Okay, that's cool. Give me bonus advantages in battle. Alright. Alright, no. I don't want that. Fries and a shake. Let's see if that's a... It's almost like all my cash, but... Who's hungry? <laughs> I, I love the style there. Thanks for the meal. So is that... I, I don't know, I'm just curious. That Nope, okay, that's not a menu set. Alright. I'll play around with that. 
There we go. Just in case we were about to get into a fight, I wanted to uh, try and get my HP back up. Especially because that last fight, they made me use all my... Or only use skills. Is our guy here? Sure is. Look over there. That's Hiratsuka. <laughs> that dude, huh? Do you know him? Forget it. Let's go. Hey there, Hiratsuka-san. Enjoying a little break, are we? Having a smoke while you mooch your ass still owes a ton of money? Oh, you think we won't beat you to a pulp? That other family went easy on you, but we won't. The Arakawa family doesn't fuck around. If you don't want to get hurt, get out your wallet. Hey, you think I won't do it? I can't pay back what I can't pay back. That's all there is to it. I see you're still just coasting on your size, oh great Hiratsuka. How'd you know that nickname? Who the hell are you? Aw, oh, don't you remember, pal? We used to wrestle when we were kids. You thought it was so cool to powerbomb other kids, as long as you were the only one big enough to do it. Oh, I remember. You're Soapy Ichi. And if this guy's your pal, that must mean... <laughs> you ended up in the Yakuza. Shocker. And I heard you joined the JSDF only to flunk out and come crawling back here. Life's a bitch, huh? Yeah, it is. So deal with it somewhere else. No can do, pal. We gotta deal with it right here, cause we're Yakuza. See, Yakuza orders are mandatory, and my orders are to get your wallet. So hand it over. I told you, I don't have any money! Come on, great son. Let's make this easy. All I need is your wallet. I don't want to get rough with you. You understand, right? <laughs> You saying that even a grown-ass man is scared of my power bombs? Yeah, I'm saying I don't want to see the strongest guy in middle school tap out. It'd be a shame if that was your peak. Huh. Sounds like Soapy Ichi needs to taste the dirt again. You want it so bad? Try and take it! Here we go! Tag match, Aniki! Not this time. You be the referee. I want him all to myself. Huh? Quit jabbering, and let's do this! Come on! Let's do it! Koji Hiratsuki. Cool. Hiratsuka. Hiratsuka. Alright, I wanted to turn off that high resolution. It's making my eyes hurt. Alright, uh, what to do? Let's go... Let's go Tenacious Fist. Check this out! I gotta get that block down, or that perfect guard, or whatever. I feel the stats going up! <laughs> Alright, all around boost. I love how it's literally called magic. <laughs> There's a stat called magic in a Yakuza game. <sighs> You're still pretty strong. <sighs> But not strong enough. Say goodbye to your wallet. Please, beat me up if that's what your boss wants. But don't take my money! Well, looky here. He did have the cash. This fucking lowlife had no intention of paying it back. Hey, wait. What are you doing? Aniki! What? Just getting all the junk out of his wallet first, man. Looks more like money to me. All right, great son. Like I said, I only wanted your wallet. Huh? Oh. Okay. Okay, 
Let's go, Mitsu. Hey, Hariki! What's up with you? Why did you take the money? Hiratsuka won't screw us. He'll pay it off if we just give him time. How you figure that? You think he's out here working his ass off, doing construction on New Year's Eve just for fun? Didn't you notice what he was smoking? It was just a nub, man. He obviously just picked it up off the ground. Why'd he do that if he had so much cash? Because it's New Year's. He probably wanted to buy his mom a nice meal, so he got some cash out of the bank, you know? That doesn't mean it's okay to be late on his payments. Look, you know that old candy shop just past Showa Street? Uh, yeah, it closed last year, right? What about it? Hiratsuka's mom ran that shop. Really? She closed it because she got sick. Real sick. I went to see her in the hospital, and she was thin as a rail. But even so, she was happy, because her son was back in Kamarocho, taking care of her. So, that money Hiratsuka borrowed was... It was all for her hospital bills. Oh. But, dude, if we go back empty-handed, Captain Sawashiro's gonna kill us! We're not going back empty-handed. We were asked to snatch the dude's wallet. And look, that's exactly what we snatched. You know that's not what the captain meant. Hey, speak of the devil. For real? Hello, this is Ichiban. You're slow. I told you to pick up within two rings. Sorry, Captain. Don't tell me you're still out there doing collections. Just finished up the last one, sir. I'm about to head back to the office. That'd be great. Except right now you should be with the young master. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I'll be there as fast as I can. What good is that? He still has to wait for you. Why are you always slow as shit? I'm sorry, sir! Just move your ass, and don't take him anywhere dumb or dangerous. If anything happens to him under your watch, I'd have to kill you a thousand times. Yes, I know that, sir! So you gotta go play chaperone to the young master? Yeah, damn it. I can't believe I forgot. Mitsu, take this back to the office for me. Oh, no! I'm not gonna be the one to hand this in to the captain. You just let me know when the young master lets you off your leash. I'll kill time until then. You know, maybe it's not the the high res. It, it, it's like it looks like lens flare. Or there's like a I don't know the way the light works. Yeah, I, that's what was hurting my eyes. Okay, eh, I might leave it on. I don't know. I'll watch the playback, see if anything's um, you know hard to see or whatever. Um, but you know what? I think we're actually gonna call this one here. I know a little shorter than what I wanted to do, but uh, one, I'm getting hungry and want to grab something to eat. And two, I want to make sure I have plenty of time to also get another video up today. Uh, so here's our first little glimpse and taste of Next Generation and Yakuza Like a Dragon. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I will be back um, tomorrow with more. I want to say, as always, thank you so much for watching. Social media is in the description. Like, comment, if you're not already, please subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned more next time. But until then, my name's AJ Gels. This is Something Game Channel. I'm out.